Yo, what is up guys? So, I have picked out five different pros on the all-time leaderboard and those pros are actually Dan Sarks, Courtney Elm City, Ari, Mikey and Sin. And one of them actually is the secret pro and to find that secret pro, I am going to be asking them a variety of questions, showing off their best boosts and more. Which those will hopefully help you guys identify who the secret pro is out of the five I have mentioned. And Actually as well, let me know in the comments who you think the secret pro even is out of the five before we start. And another thing you should do before we start is subscribe as we are really, really close to 100,000 subscribers and let's try to hit 1,000 likes on the dot on this video because I do know we can hit it. So first, let me show you their best boosts and show you a couple gummy stars and everything like that before I ask them the questions as well. And we have Dan Socks over here starting off by just donating to the sticker stacker. Sin is starting off by placing glitter on the field. He does have wins as well. He does have the sticker stacker buff on and his ults are ready in the field too. And Ori is starting off the same way really. He just doesn't have wins sadly. Then we have Courtney over here. He is blue high but he is starting off once again just normally. He is going up as well to get the honeybee quest and this was recorded before the new update so it kind of looks weird without having a stacker there. But he is getting that honeybee quest for the extra convert rate. And then Mikey is starting off the boost by doing a stick bug. Okay sure. Here we have the first scorching star for Dan Socks. And as you guys see, the field is looking lovely. Loads of precise marks, pollination, clouds and everything. The winds even are there. Even a guiding star actually. Wow. This is going to be a crazy one for sure. He's making really good honey per second too. But what I do want to say is how much less red makes than white hive because the boost you guys are about to see from the three white hives are insane. The difference is really big between red and white hive honey making. And he has made about 4 trillion from this Scorch Star though. Pretty nice. Now for the first White Hive boost, we have Sin getting his first Gummy Star. And let's see how big it can actually grow. There are loads of marks on the field too, obviously. He is going for them precise marks. Doing the alignment keys to make sure he gets a 10x Gumball. Now going for the Smileys. And that right there was a 19 trillion gummy star. He made about 51 trillion there. Wow. And can you guys see what I mean now too with the difference between red and white? That was beautiful to watch though. I'm not going to lie. The second white hive boost now being from Ori and he is getting his first gummy star too now. Really he is just doing the same things like, you know, getting the 10x gumball, stretching the triangulates and stuff for a nice gummy star. But let's see what he gets. And he got about 14 trillion from this gummy star. Pretty good for the start. It does get way better though, I can tell you this. Since that was just the start for him. For Courtney now, and he is the blue hive. And I'm not going to lie with you guys. I haven't watched the blue boost for like 11 months. So I am quite excited to see how it goes. Because it is looking pretty good already. As he does have guiding wins and a 72x blessing, which is huge and more. He is running pop shower as you guys can see and this is his first pop star as well the capacity for his balloons are 3.2 billion for normal and 4.1 billion for gold wait actually never mind that was before the 4x on the field they are actually way bigger 
So 7 billion for normal and like 9 billion for gold. Okay, he is filling all of them as you see too. Now let's quickly go to Mikey. Then I'll show you what blessing he got from just that. So nice, Mikey finally started the boost and isn't doing Stigbug no more. But it is his first gummy star too. And there is so much going on in the field already. So much marks. And my bad for the lower quality too on this. I don't even know why it's so bad. But let's see how much he can make with this. And oh my god, that triangle stretch was crazy. Literally the entire field was covered. And the gummy star has just ended and he made 154 trillion. Wow, I'm actually speechless, not gonna lie, that is insane. But let's go back to Courtney real quick and see what he got because I am about to ask them questions after this one too, by the way. Okay, so he got a nice low 61x blessing just from that. I'd say that's a W really, not gonna lie. He made like 5 trillion from that too, way better than White Hive 100%. Yeah, there's not even a difference at that point. So let's ask the first question. What is your biggest boost and how much do you make an hour Courtney? Since you know Courtney is Blue Hive and it's mostly macroing. Oh, well, he actually said his boost. So he said it's 30 trillion, but I get 2.5 trillion an hour a macro. Mikey's biggest boost is 5 trillion and Ori's biggest boost is is currently 1.2 quadrillion which was achieved on the honey day before the sticker update and Dan Sox's biggest boost is the demi decade boost so you know the code which was 1.4 quadrillion last year 1.15 quadrillion missed the chance to record it but had a 78 trillion gummy star wow but Mikey's actual boost was 1.9 quadrillion on honey day no festive bean and no wins no code nothing but gumdrops now the second question being how much honey do you have on you right now? So Mikey currently has 2.6 quadrillion and he has spent 7.5 quadrillion two days ago for no reason. And you can kind of tell with all the basic bees he has in his hive. Then Ori over here has 600 trillion because he keeps going attack hive, then white hive, and next day and then in repeat. So Courtney's over here is 2.25 quadrillion and Dan Sox has 9 quadrillion. Now for Sin, 44.4 quadrillion, okay. Now the third question is actually quite interesting and I actually really want to see this because it's what's your total playtime? And let's start with Mikey again. So Mikey has 554 days, Ori has 818 days, Courtney Elm City has 1433 and Dan Sox has 989 days. Now for Sin, he has 756 days with 16 hours. Hours. Wow. For the fourth question, we are going to ask how many alt accounts do you have? Mikey has only one, which has 25 Bs, but is borrowing five. Ori has 12 alt accounts in total. Courtney has two with 50 Bs, level 20 hives, and two trash ones. And Dan Sox has five. Sin has two fuzzy alts and six level 15, 18 hives that are guiding alts that he farms gumdrops on. And now for the last question, we have which material do you have the most of mikey has spent one quadrillion honey on mythic mutation so i guess that's the most material he has then ori has 400 million real jelly courtney has 48 bumblebee eggs and dan Sox has 286 million real jelly now for sin so he said that he isn't the best at maths he doesn't have as much as any other rich players known as contemption alt and ethan olo dj but but he can say he does have 18 gifted mythic eggs. Wow, that's one more than me. Right, now let me show you the best parts in the boosts, the most interesting parts before I reveal who the secret pro is. And I do think that these boost numbers I'm about to show will help you identify who it actually is. So let's start with Dan Sox again, and he has made 199 trillion since we last seen him. Really, really good. Let's watch this last scorching star from him and see how much he makes overall. 
Right, so the red boost for the top one red hive has ended and he has made 237 trillion. I'd say that's really impressive. Now we have Sin over here. He has made 210 trillion since we last seen him and let's see how much more he can make. And now, Sin has made one quadrillion honey in this boost. Absolutely insane. For Ori, I do think the best moment is using a festive bean in his boost, which is why we are about to watch it. But he has made about 400 trillion honey since we last seen him. Okay, and let's see how much he makes with this festive bean and what he makes overall in a second. Now, overall, he has made 1.2 quadrillion honey in that boost, but like 4 quadrillion in that day already. Wow, wow, wow. So for Courtney, he still is grinding away in Pine Tree, but he has made about 15 trillion honey since we last saw him. And overall, he basically made that much because blue boosts are trash, but he hasn't boosted for that long anyway, though. For the third white hive, Mikey now, we have another gummy star from him there, but he made about 756 trillion honey since we last seen him, which the numbers just be getting larger and larger each time. And I also don't know if I mentioned that this is the boost he hit 100 quadrillion honey with and got to top one all time leaderboard. But let's see how much he ends up making overall here. And now for the end, he has basically made one quadrillion honey in this boost and hit the top one all-time leaderboard, as I said. So after watching all those boosts, seeing the pros answer the questions, I am going to be revealing who the secret pro is. But before I do, let me know once again in the comments on your final choice of who it is before the big reveal. Because now for the big reveal of who the secret pro actually is, after all the boosts, after all the questions, let's see who actually got it right. So in three, in two, and in one, it is Sinny Sin Sin. So Sin is actually the secret pro. Let me know in the comments who actually guessed it correctly because it was quite an interesting one. I don't think much people actually expected Sin to be the secret pro. I think a lot of people actually expected Mikey to be the secret pro. And I do think it was quite a clue though because he is number one on daily every day. But yeah, I mean, I hope you guys have actually enjoyed the video and shout out to everyone that actually was in the video. So Ori, Sin, Mikey, Courtney, Dan Socks. Shout out to them and thank you so much for watching and bye!